Hi everyone, welcome to my Story YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see about the 8th cranial you know, applied anatomy. The first one is, it leads to the loss of hearing sensation. There are types of loss of hearing sensation. One is conductive deafness, which is the failure of the wave to reach the cochlea. When the cochlea, when the, these waves, sound waves reaches the cochlea, there will be hearness. And there is failure of this wave to reach the cochlea. This leads to the deafness. The second one is sensoroneural deafness. This failure to production, the transmission of the action potential due to the cochlea disease. When there is a problem in the cochlea disease, cochlea this leads to the uh, production of the action potential so it may lead to the deafness the cochlea nerve disease comes caused due to the defect in the cochlea nerve and the central connection the cortical deafness is the bilateral or dominant posterior temporal oblation which results in the failure to understand the spoken language though the hearing is preserved and the hearing is here but they does not understand the spoken language due to the lesion in the temporal region these are the types of the deafness. These are the kind of types of deafness, hearing loss. The vertigo, this is the illusion of the rotary movement due to the disturbed in orientation of the body space. The patient feels like the environment is moving and this disease is due to the vestibular nerve. This disease is due to the vestibular nerve. Any disease in the vestibular nerve causes vertigo where there will be rotatory motion of this the environment. But it won't be actually not present. The rotary moon will not be present. But the patient feels like the environment is moving. The tinnitus is sensation or buzzing or ringing, hissing, and the bilateral of the high or low pitch continuous and intermittent. These are the sensation which is present. That tinnitus, the main the minor syndrome, which is characterized by the recurrent attack of tinnitus, vertigo, hearing loss, accompanied with the sensitivity of nose. This four is combined together to form this syndrome and there will be, it affects the middle aged and the older person. In the condition there will be increased volume of endolymph. The acoustic neuroma is a slow growing length tumor of the neurolemal cells. It causes early loss of the hearing. It will be causing the early loss due to the growing tumor. Neural muscles causes early. There will be acoustic neuroma, slow growing tumor. That's all. Thank you. If you like this video, please do like, share, and subscribe my YouTube channel. If you have any doubt in it, comment it. For more videos, please do subscribe. Thank you.